Students, don't you think that modern classes are more interactive and attractive than the traditional classrooms? Do you know why? Because nowadays the teachers are very smart. They use different types of audiovisual aids in the classroom to make the class attractive for the students. But what are these audiovisual aids? Students, would you like to discuss with me about these audiovisual aids? So, let's start the class. But before going to discuss about these audiovisual aids, I would like to speak a few sentences about our sense organs. Students, all of you know that there are five sense organs in human body. All these five sense organs have their specific function in our body. It is due to the functioning of these sense organs, our brain is connected with the external world. No information can reach our brain in the absence of this sense organ. Students, do you know that our sense organs are also called gateways of knowledge? Do you know why? Because our sense organs are like the instrument of our brain. It is only with the help of these sense organs that our brain receives all sorts of information. In the absence of these sense organs, we cannot acquire any knowledge. This is the reason that these are called the gateways of our knowledge. Among these five sense organs, these two sense organs, that is our eyes and ears, are directly connected with the process of teaching and learning because in the absence of these two sense organs, we cannot learn anything. Audiovisual aids are used in the classroom to stimulate these two sense organs of the student so that the process of teaching and learning becomes more effective. Students, the word audiovisual is the combination of two words. One is audio and the other is visual. Audio means to hear and visual means to see. Therefore, audiovisual aids implies those aids or devices with the help of which we can both hear and visualize the information. Students, you must have seen tape recorder, microphone, earphones, etc. What are these devices? These are audio devices. These devices help us to hear different types of sound. So, audio devices are those devices which stimulates our auditory sense organs and with the help of which we can hear the sound of different types of information. For example, tape recorder, microphones, earphones, etc. Students, in your classroom, you must have seen your teachers using chart, chalkboard, globe, etc. But why do your teachers use these aids in the classroom? Your teacher uses these aids in the classroom for the visual presentation of various types of information before you. Therefore, visual devices are those devices which stimulates our visual sense organs so that we can visualize the information very clearly present before us. For example, chalkboard, globe, chart, etc. But there are some devices which stimulates our auditory sense organs and our visual sense organs at the same time and with the help of which we can hear as well as visualize the information at the same time are called audiovisual aids. For example, television, computer, smart board, etc. Audiovisual aids are used to communicate with the students more effectively. Students, when these audiovisual aids or devices are applied in the classroom to make the process of teaching and learning more effective, these aids are called teaching aids. These teaching aids are also known as instructional aids. Students, today we have discussed about the meaning of audiovisual aids. In my next video, I will discuss about the application of these audiovisual aids in the classroom situation. Thank you everyone. Thank you for watching my video.